Hello everyone, what's up, welcome back to Homemade Madness and you're joining me in part 3 of my quest to build the smallest possible 4 wheel drive buggy. In the previous two parts of this build series, I first made a full CAD model and built a frame and then I gave it fully independent suspension. And this is what I've got so far, it's a rolling frame with perfectly working suspension. And today I'll be first taking it apart so I can weld the frame and then I'll make a custom gas tank and I'll be hooking up the all wheel drive drive line. So let's take it apart and start welding. So with the frame fully welded, it's time to put in the engine, connect the controls and build the driveline. Now I haven't really talked much about this engine yet, but it's a 250cc 4 stroke engine from a quad bike, with 4 gears and a reverse, which will be very useful. It should make around 20 horsepower, which isn't insanely much, but definitely enough for such a small vehicle. Now let's make a gas tank. I want to make it out of stainless to avoid any rust issues. And this piece I've got here is just big enough but the material is really thin so let's see if I can make it work. Thank you. 
with the fuel tank down, let's start making the drivetrain. This is how it will work. A chain coming from the engine will go to this shaft in the middle of the vehicle. And then there will be one chain coming from this shaft, going under the engine to the front. And another chain going from this shaft to the rear wheels on the side here. I also want to make the center shaft adjustable to tension the chains like this. And finally, the front wheels will be driven by these U-joints. They come from a car steering system and thanks to the adjustable steering wheel, they can slide in and out, which will also happen as the front suspension travels.